everyone, Spectre here. Uh, the video you're about to watch is a mini video compilation of everything that we I reacted to with Crazy Quill Man. Uh, this was made with, in collaboration with him, and it was edited by Madam Starfall, and I love them both very much. Um, a preface to the whole thing, uh, I'm not exactly happy with the final product. I Not because Madam Starfall did a bad job, but, uh, but mostly because I'm not entirely sure how I like the way I look. I'm probably going to try a different look the next time I record new memes, and also I didn't realize how much I slipped out of my femme voice. I got a lot better since then, as you can probably hear from this current recording, but, like, um, a long time ago, I kept slipping in and out of it, and, well, uh, I'm not exactly happy with it, and... I hope you still at least a good get a good laugh. I know I did, but in the meantime, I hope you enjoy this video. This is what ha this is what happens when you record on the spot and ask for memes for your from your audience. Yeah, whose idea was this? <laughs> I have no idea. I'm just going to I'm just going to assume it was yours and blame you for it. Considering the fact that I'm the new guy on the channel, the audience would probably believe that first. Hey everyone, I'm on the camera for once in a long time. Uh, we're gonna look at me. Isn't she great? We're we're kind of we're kind of new to this. We're just kind of go. We're just kind of winging it. Uh, we ask for memes in the Discord channel that we launched. For those of you who want to join the Discord, link in the description. And uh, yeah, just give us more memes because uh, you gave us a lot to work with, and I think we can just make a lot of these videos honestly so let's just jump right into it first the inaugural meme of of our uh, god what are we gonna call this show we'll worry about that later oh uh, yeah yeah let's worry about that later when we actually get to posting this roses are red it's hot like hell and then there's a picture of mitochondria Mitochondria is the power of the cell, powerhouse of the cell. I get it. I get it. I love the I love the comment. Uh, I love the comment following it of today on images you can hear. <laughs> Where's Waluigi? Oh gee, I don't think I can find him. I love this. I love this image. Brawl of the family. I freaking miss it. But uh, <laughs> the fact that the guy like, guest of all things is also running away from him. K rules face there is also really good. Just like. <laughs> <laughs> every time I look at this image, because I posted this one, every time I look at this image, I see a new guy I hadn't noticed before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Every freaking time. So, like, um, oh, what's his what's his name? Because I I don't, I'm I'm gonna be honest, fake fan, haven't played uh, any of the Zelda games. Um, uh, but it's that uh, it's that drumming boss from uh, Ocarina is up there in the corner. Oh my god! It's oh yeah, uh, Bongo Bongo. That's the name of it. <laughs> yeah. So that's the new one I noticed this time around. <laughs> nice. Curzon, my beloved old friend. I'm Judzia now. Judzia, my beloved old friend. If Clean can yeah. get it, so can you. Trans <laughs> memes. We we love yeah. to see it. <laughs> Man, imagine being less based than the Klingons. Ugh. <laughs> Pain-inducing. <laughs> Cringe. Tonight, God will slay the first son of each family. Politically oh, accurate oh, blue oh. shell. <laughs> Be very afraid. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, Hop Pop makes some modifications to the music box. Fine, I'll do it myself. <laughs> oh christ uh if there's one thing i didn't anticipate it's um hot pop thanos and the infinity jukebox <laughs> baby stats of bi ivs baby was released mom if you don't like my breathing method stop imagining me having children's <laughs> <laughs> that is stupid God. Well, this next one's apt. It's, it's how it's how I react when when I'm showing off Starfall to people. Look how cute God. my partner is. She is a damn cute partner. Yes, she is. She is adorable. And you better not skip this one, Starfall. <laughs> Stop it. Hey, 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 hey! Don't press that button. I cast upon thee, mild inconvenience. That tiny thing in your sock poking your toe, but you can't. Find it drives me crazy. Yeah, that's uh, that's that's pretty bad. I I will say I love the fact that there's been so many people who are like, 
Abracadabra flagellus caution. Give that wizard testicular torsion! <laughs> No, mild inconvenience is a thousand percent worse. <laughs> because mild inconvenience is a spell that can stack per level. Testicular torsion is a level nine spell. Cryptids of Florida, Bearcat, Borinkus, Chupacabra, the Hog Bo Hog Kong? That's a Hog Kong? Buck I am unfamiliar with Old this. Hitler! <laughs> Skinny Gargoyle! <laughs> What the hell's a skunk ape? Wait a minute, snolagoster? What the fuck is a snolagoster? Trident oh, Sea what? Monster. That's not even creative. And the Wampus Cat, because of course. Womp womp, baby. I need to find out more about the snolagoster. <laughs> I am having fun fun. No one can see me. No, you gotta do it in the voice. As long as you're doing the Kermit the Frog voice. God damn it, you're right. All right. I'm having fun from no one can see me. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. That's the take. <laughs> what? Watch Madam Starfall not cut a single bit of that out. Oh well. <laughs> We're out of tires. How how did you make your throat do that? That's what she said. <laughs> Just a reminder that most of H.P. Lovecraft's stories are set in or near Massachusetts. Therefore, you should be giving all of the characters Bostonian accents. Oh my god! It's an Eldritch Horror from Beyond the Stars! <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, accurate. it's so accurate. God. I love that meme so much. Oh my god. I, I didn't even think about that, but that's that's a good point. And now, as an interval between memes, we give you the Shiggy Wiggy. I have no idea what's happening. In 1663, the partial fossilized skeleton of the <coughs> Rhinoceros was discovered in Germany. This is the Magdeburg Unicorn, one of the worst fossil reconstructions in human history. <laughs> that is beautiful. I love that. <laughs> it's a work of art. It belongs in a- wait, never mind. It's already in the museum, <laughs> and it was- Yeah, actually, exactly. they fucked it up! I a deficiency be like, oh god, I'm falling. Oh god, I'm dying. <laughs> oh, I'm dying again. My husband upset me this morning, and now I'm inflicting it on all of you. Drow elves! Oh. Australians. <laughs> Live in a place called the Underdark. Live in a place called Down Under. Exiled from the surface. Exiled by the English. Known for dangerous creatures, including big spiders. Conclusion? The drow have Australian accents. <laughs> no. Don't do this to me. I, I love this. I love this. No. You, you get captured by a swarm of drow, and the, the spiders go like... And we're, like, gonna, we're gonna we're gonna sacrifice you to the goddess Loth. I've done it! I've made the perfect creature! Now we're just a pinch of silly. Oof. Oh, listen, I am so sorry. That is completely reverse irreversible. I I don't know if this is you so much as it is Starfall. Definitely like, Starfall. It's all of us to some extent. But it, it's very her. Like, like I managed to get that pinch of silly. She got the whole fucking bucket. Yeah. <laughs> and we love her for it. Praise you, Green Mountain Man! Waving many hands made of money! Say hello to your brother! I have no clue what the fuck just happened. This should happen! Coffin that launches your body at it once you hit a certain level of decomposition after dying. Oh my god. I love that. That's awful. But I love it. I mean, hey. You know, with... <laughs> With limited land, we only have so much space to actually keep people buried. Well, I have a proposition on how we improve flails. Oh, no. I love the fact that two people responded with a screwdriver. <laughs> I've had the demon core explained to me like six times and I still don't understand it. You're the dice. You're the dice. You're the dice. Gone. I don't. Okay, this is this is a joke I'm once again lost on. 
Yeah, I, I think it's, I think it's, I think we need the, the context of, like, Greek mythology for that. Uh, you know what? Uh, Starfall, come on and, come on and explain that one. My pleasure, Quill. You see, Orpheus was known as one of the most talented musicians of the ancient times. It was said that his parents were actually Apollo, the sun god, and one of the nine muses, Calliope. As a boy, he was presented with a lyre, which he had mastered in no time at all. Orpheus was said to have a divinely gifted voice that could try everyone who heard it, whether they be human or animal. Not even the gods themselves could resist his music. But he was also an adventurous character. He was essentially the classic bard. He actually joined the Sailor Dragons. By his early years, he actually spent a lot of time playing concerts. At least, he had the most beautiful women that he's ever seen. Her name was Rizzi, not your dice, etc. It was love at first sight for the two of them, and they became Mary Mills' no time at all. Watch how she started to do the same thing. After that, it was like, he was no more than the same for the same reason. But he was like, 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 he Another year, another it is what it is. You'll get knocked down. That's life. You can't stay down. You gotta get back on the horse. <laughs> and again, it is pretty cozy down here. Psycho <laughs> <laughs> of a horse. God. Oh, man. God, the, oh the freaking cheap tuna element is just really good. It's so cute. <laughs>